Hello, Golfer for Life here with an update for my 2013 in the bag. So, I've made a few changes to my clubs, one of which is my wedge setup. Before you knew that I had the 54, 58, and 62 degrees, now I've took out the um, 62 and the 58 and replaced it with a 60 degree. This is the 60 degree CG15 Black Pearl. And it has on it a Golf Pride White and Blue Multi Compound. Um, I like this way of this wedge setup more because it gives me sort of less of less options for shots, but it makes it easier for me to choose which shots I need or which uh, wedge I need for each shot. So. Yeah, it's not very, it's not really much of a change because it's the same wedge. But um, so then I saw the fifty four degree. My irons are the same. They're the Mizuno JPX eight hundred Pros. Um, they're great iron. They're comparable, I think, to the AP twos. The only thing is that these have a little bit of a bigger head, so they're easier to hit. They have the Project X, let's see if you can see that, 5.0 shafts with the stock uh, M21 grips by Golf Prime. Um, I have pitch through four in that. I'll show you the four iron. What I like about these is that they don't have a lot of offset. So you can see not much offset there. It does have a bit of a thicker uh, top line, but... It just, it, it looks fine to me. For my hybrid, another change. I have, I got the Adams Pro A12 hybrid. I love this head cover. You just have to open the door and slide it out. Um, this is a little tiny hybrid. It's not very easy to hit. But when you hit it well, it feels so nice. It just goes, it's very nice out of the rough because it's thin and it can go through the rough really well. It has a nunchuck stiff tour shaft. Not many people have the nunchuck, but it's a, it's a great shaft. And it has a Lambkin uh, dual density, right there, dual density cross line grip. It's kind of thick, but it's nice. Uh, so there's my hybrid. My fairway wood is another change. Uh, I got the Titleist 910F. Now this is kind of interesting. I don't have a 3 wood in the bag. I only have a 5 wood. But this 5 wood feels great. Goes the perfect amount of distance. Um, it is soft. It's a small head. And it's a shallow face so I can hit it really well uh, from the fairway. It has... A um, Diamana Kylie stiff shaft with a Golf Pride um, multi compound on it. So that's my hybrid. And my newest addition to the bag is the big boy, the Titleist 913 D2, D3, sorry. I love this driver. I got this like two days ago. It's a 9.5 degree. Uh, I have it set up. Here, let me see if I can focus this in for a minute. No, you can't see that. But it's in a B2, which is standard loft but closed or upright, whichever it is. Um, right now, the shaft I have in it is an all oil rip, stiff, but. I'm just trying out the shaft. What's what came in it, which I don't know why, is the um the uh, um Diamana S plus, which is pretty much the Kylie uh sixty two gram X Flex. So I'm changing I'm hopefully gonna get the uh S plus in a stiff shaft. Just to exchange that. This is a great club. I hate it further than the R11. It's softer. It's just money. So my putter is the same. It 
It's the Scotty Camera Newport 2. This is from like 2010, I think. It is just perfect. It has the Super Stroke Slim 3.0 grip on it. So it's just it's just money. I sink a lot of putts with that. Um, for balls, I'm using the Pro V1X, the 2013 Pro V1X balls, high number. Um, these are great balls. They're soft. They go a long distance, and I they, I really think they improved the durability of them because the the um, outer layer does not scuff or do anything even after 18 holes. Water bottle in my bag. This is a um, Titleist 14 way uh, light stand bag. And here, I got some empty ball things, some random balls. I got my teas, teas in here. Um, the glove that I'm currently using is a um, player's glove. It's really thin. I think it's time for a new glove. But, um, yeah, I'm about to get a new one. And my shoes, a new addition. The Addy Pure shoes. They're great, great shoes. They're, like, real leather and then just nice, comfortable shoes. Um, my rangefinder, I have a Bushnell. It's the um, Torsi 6 still. It's a great rangefinder. Really, the thing about rangefinders is that they don't really improve. You you stick with a rangefinder for a long time. Um, so I'll probably have that for a while. And that is my in the bag. Oh, one more thing. I have 13 clubs in my bag right now. If you guys have, after seeing my set, if you guys have an idea of another club that I can put in my bag, because um, I really don't know, but that would be awesome. If you could just leave that down in the comments. Thanks for watching my video.